my girlfriend and I were um, we were watching a baseball game recently, and while we were watching it, my girlfriend made the comment, um, "Oh, he's cute," about one of the baseball players. So you guys ever do this? I went and looked up that baseball player's Twitter bio. <laughs> And I'm like, okay, here we go. Um, I love my team, I love baseball, love my city, blah, blah, blah. Oh, here we go. Disciple of Jesus, follower of Christ. Yes! <laughs> hey, babe, remember that baseball player you thought was cute? Turns out he's super Christian. Guess he's not so cute anymore. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then she's like, James, what is wrong with you? I made that comment eight months ago! You know, and then you're like, well, I still don't want you to like anybody! You know, and then she's like, I told you you need to talk to somebody! You know, and then you're like, no, I don't, I'm fine! You know, and then she's like, I'm leaving! And like, Look, relationships. <laughs> if you guys got them figured out, give me a call. <laughs> Holy smokes. <laughs> it is funny, though, because a lot of these baseball players do seem to be religious, right? Like, a guy hits a home run and you see him do the cross, or strikes a guy out and he thanks God, you know. But it seems like it's only the Christian baseball players that make a big show of it, right? Like you never see baseball players from other religions making a big deal of things, right? You never see Jewish baseball players doing anything, or Hindu baseball players, or Satanist baseball players, you know? Here comes Garcia to the plate, and he hits a home run! Now comes the part where he points to hell <laughs> and mimes slitting the throat of the pig. <laughs> Let's himself be covered by all of its hot, hot blood. <laughs> For nothing, Marlin. 